our balcony of our apartment in Fusion Polka. There's a crazy music concert going on down there last night. It's a very pretty apartment. Oh, now I got light in here. This is the big bedroom. Joni's private presidential suite. See? Very pretty. Our teeny tiny little closet bathroom. And this is the sorority house room. Angie's not decent, so I won't film her. This was prettier before all the beds were torn up. It's still pretty. Here's the hallway and the kitchen. I We are currently roaming the streets of Cluj Napoca looking for something to eat. Alright, so we're here at Hayubachu Forest getting ready to go into the clearing and see what we can see. We've got a guide, Alex, here who's going to make sure we get out alive, hopefully. If not, Mom will love you. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Peace out. <laughs> we are here at the edge of the Hayubachu Forest. Where are we going? Uh, up, up the hill. What's that? Oh, I don't know. What? Like a... A wire. A wire, yes. Uh. Some of these. <coughs> the name, uh, do you know the, uh, from where the name of the forest <laughs> is coming? <laughs> like... Hoya means plains. Okay. And Bachu means shepherd. The plains of the shepherd. The story about the forest is about a shepherd who disappeared, like vanished, with his entire flock of sheep. I have to tell you that Romanian people are quite superstitious, especially the ones that live in the countryside, and mostly the ones that live in the mountains, in remote villages. They have lots of stories about ghosts and they call uh, them Spigoi, like souls of people that are not aware that they are dead. But there are many other things, like sounds that you hear, like crying women in the forest sometimes, you can, or doors cracking, or other kind of weird noises. Have you heard that? Yeah, a couple of times, well, I think three or four times. And but people that are coming here, and for the first time, you can get really panicked or afraid, so... That what we're walking in. That's just mud. That's mud. Look at my shoes. Ooh. Look. <laughs> mud. <laughs> right now I am wandering through a Romanian forest, the Hoyabachu forest, at night in the dark. See, it's very dark. Guys, where are am I? And there are people camping in the middle, in the circle, in the clearing. Because which they suck. And they have swords, and I think they're some kind of cult, and they might kill us.
we... you're filming us now? Oh, yeah. wonderful. You look beautiful, don't worry. You're going to edit us out, we'll be fine, right? <laughs> <laughs> we'll black your faces out. Okay. Oh, good. Yeah. I can't even see your faces, to be honest with you. Okay, so what's your sense here so far? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Nothing. That's Peace. Good. Bunch of guys camping, having a good time. Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Well, that's good. Yeah. We're just beginning, though, really, though. We're, we haven't been here too long. So you'll be around a while? Probably. Yeah. yeah. But you we'll pass, try to be quiet. If you, pass no, through, no, no, if you pass through again, we'll be here. Okay. It's cigar time after this. We'll be up a while. <laughs> you guys, so did you, do you have swords out here? We yep. have swords. Oh, you do have swords. All right. Well, yes. you, you talked to someone else who told you there were guys with swords out here? Yes. Yeah. Uh, what? Uh, they came, up, <laughs> they came up and said, hey, and then they looked there like, uh, you yeah. have swords. Like, yeah, hey, the, we're not, the trees I got to ask, here. why do you have swords? You well, guys. So, since you asked, we're, yep. from, we're from a church. Uh -huh. together and we actually came up here because of all of the uh the superstition and the uh, legends and stuff and we've actually we camped out and fasted and prayed for three days oh, oh very cool so, oh so this is the end of the fast this yeah. is the yes oh, we yeah. eat tonight and so then you're uh, celebrating. We some, and we'll go home tomorrow and so that's why when you said we said what do you said so far nothing like, well that's good maybe we feel like we had some accomplishment no don't scare it away oh don't scare no. it away <laughs> <laughs> sorry <laughs> And no, it's not our goal to bring it back. Well, <laughs> we figure it's better for our city if it's not here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. But if you do see something, scream. We'll come run, okay? Okay. All right, guys. Will you bring your swords? Back. We'll bring our swords. Excellent. Yeah. Markings on the ground. It's called self-preservation. It's called adventure. What are you doing with this, lady? We are looking at satanic signs in the forest, getting ready to go chase down some psychos with swords because they think this is an adventure. Chasing after psychos is not my idea of a good time. the demons. Tree sap, isn't it? No, I got black paint on my fingers now. It's okay. I got mud all over my shoes. Now what's the G stand for? I don't know. I don't think it's. And we are. What the hell are you? What G? There's a G over there. Where? Gothic? No, no. God. God. I don't remember seeing it, but also I don't remember not seeing it. Yeah, maybe it was our friends out there. Who painted over this shit? I bet it was. So they're either like cultish or they're some fucking super fundamentalistic well, yeah, it was crazy good. psychos. Oh, there's a red X. What's that? Pink. Where? That's the tree's the... coming down? Yeah, the tree's coming down. That's oh. usually what it means back home. Look at you, Miss Park Ranger. We're actually headed back in the direction of the psycho cult guys with the uh, swords. Mandy doesn't want to. <laughs> but you know I have to see what they're doing so we're gonna go check it out I'm going on record as being the one opposed to going back to the crazy psychos with swords and yet this is the direction that we are headed so if we're beheaded I am throwing Angie to the lions and running the other way Okay, I'm in the clearing, the forest, in the campground. Can't really tell if anything weird is happening because of this. Although that's its own brand of scary over there. I wouldn't say we're lost, but I don't think we know exactly where we are. And I think our guides turned around, which is kind of cool. Because apparently we can't find the road.